Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to the channel. I am Malcolm Ash, and this is Trapped Like Animals, a game by Wrath of Wood, created in RPG Maker using MV3D. Let us begin. Could be MZ3D. Catherine, is this a, like, gothic cat girl? Thanks for chilling. I know you are super busy. Callie, oh yeah, you have no clue how crazy the shop is getting these days. Hey, you are good at video games, right? Check this out. I could not get it to work. Is that what I think it is? An Intellistation 64 and Knuckles? What? Have you played this? No, but I was watching Dangerbred stream it. That was their last video. Is Dangerbred a real streamer? Is it any good? I don't remember much. I think it's like an old school retro style. Let's fire it up. Let me try this. That's it? I knew you would make me look stupid. First try and it works for you. I guess I just have the magic touch. Golly, come sit. 18 feet away on this couch. This game is pretty cool so far. You haven't even pressed start. You filthy casual. Oh, I love this. Love it. Look at me! Detective Mallard, am I, is that? That's awesome. Look at me. I am such a good unit. I have to talk to the chief. He has a job for me. It's my office, but the chief needs to see me about something important. <laughs> Hamlet's office. Hamlet? Is he a piggy? I should leave him alone. His office is... Oops. His office is covered in... Is it mud? Yes, and feces. Aw. The smell is getting a little moist. <laughs> the chief. Thank you for coming in. He is also a piggy. I have no time to waste. You know I can never refuse a paying job. This morning I got a call. Two girls are reported missing. Oh god, it's the same girls playing this game. Catherine Longhair and Callie... Co something. Any suspects? We do not have any leads. Our pigs checked out the house and found the... Oh, I get it. All over the country, people have been going missing. Let's players, streamers, game critics, casuals... This was the last game they played. Oh, this isn't the game we are playing. Uh, this is what happens after those two ladies played that game. It's hitting me like a ton of bricks now. The only thing linking the disappearances together is this damn video game. Wink. Where did they buy this? The owner left town, closed up just as quick as they popped in. Wink. Whoops. I can't have this in my town. Find out what happened to these two girls, he said, before I accidentally clicked the uh, advanced text button. Looks like an unofficial homebrew game. I would not trust it. There could be anything in there. All right, sir. I'll do whatever I can to get to the bottom of this. Except put that in my PC. For better or worse, you always do, Mallard. Don't mention it. Like ever. Please don't remind me, sir. The place is clean. No signs of a struggle. Only clue I have is this game. Oh, wow. The scented candle smells like vanilla. The title of the painting says The Slasher. I do not think this is relevant right now. I don't think it is either, even though it looks like a ship. And ships are cool. And this smells like oranges. These scented candles burn for an unbelievable amount of time. And there's a TV and game console here. I should at least take a look at the game. Oh god. Welcome. It's pulling me in! Oh, breadcrumbs. Now what have I gotten myself into, quack? The creator programmed a way to really suck in players. Gemeralds. Zero out of three. You got a gemerald! Thanks. Whack. 
<laughs> quack, not quack. But also quack. quack. Are you a piece of cheese? Hey, what's going on here? Ha uh, ha. Uh, it is me, the Game Master. You have to call me the Game Master. Ha uh, ha. Uh. Oh, he is. He's a, he's a piece of American processed cheese product. Why is that tree glitchy? I don't get to have an answer. Well, I want to make sure I find all of the gemeralds. So, you got a gemerald. I tell you. Oh god, haha. <laughs> I control everything around here because I am the game master. <laughs> Don't run, I need to ask you some questions. Quack. Like, get back here, punk ass. Uh, let's save, just in case I die horribly. Uh, and let's skip getting that gem rose. Whoa. Why do you keep following me? It's very weird. Hold on, I need your help. We're gonna skip that gem world on purpose in case, uh, in case there's more. Ha ha, you did not collect all the gem worlds. Try again to progress, ha ha. Hey, you didn't even tell me I had to find all the things. <laughs> Let me introduce you to my little friend, the gem world counter, ha ha. Please back up. Please bring me three gem worlds, ha ha. Okay. Well, I'm glad I got to find that funky little bit of text. You know me, completionist Ash over here, so what do you think of the place? Personally, I think it looks like the Green Hill Zone, but dumbed down by approximately two bits and without any of the speed. I created everything you see here. My world has the technology to create dimension-bending tools. Both you and I are characters in a game, always have been, and always will be. That's not true. I came from the real world. <laughs> But you came from your world, and I came from mine. My world does not have talking ducks. This game links my human world with your animal world. None of this is making sense. I am just here for the two girls. Where are they? Is that Wrath of Wood? In processed cheese character form? Haha, <laughs> you will have to catch me to find out. Well, that's not fair, because you're up on the cliff, and you didn't leave me a way to get up there. Oh god, it's a spinning stair tile. If that's not a reason to save, I don't know what is. Okay. This is charming. This is fine. Aha. Oh shoot, the stairs goes here. I forgot to change that back to the forest levels. I'm looking for two missing girls. Did they come here, quack? I have collected many. I am an incel, and it's the only way I can get them. My collection is growing larger and larger. Soon you will join them. Because I'm beginning to develop a thing for ducks. Alright. Uh, lights! Come see for yourself. Don't listen to this jerk. Everything is a trap. Hi girls, help! Get us out of here! We are trapped like animals. It's no use. He always makes the new ones run through the mazes. Josh, be good kitties. You'll spoil it for people who have not seen it yet. Haha. <laughs> The only reason you are still up here is because it's fun to watch you run around, much like a rat in a maze, looking for cheese. While avoiding this shock of a false move, you two will get piece of cheese if you do well. OMG, is he doing the you are just a rat with lights in a box things again? Well I am out of here, haha, <laughs> watch your step by the pit, I only put that there to remind you of your goal. Also, gemeralds, tasty gemeralds. Keep bringing me them gemeralds. That's a save. That's a save if I ever heard one. Don't worry, girls. I'm going to save you. Maybe. Now. Some parts are unfinished. Watch your step. Ha ah, ah. ha. Work in progress for years and I still have not fixed some of the bugs. Oh well. Ha ah, ah. ha. Ah, that's just game dev life, bro. Ha ah, ha. You think you can just leave? Clearly, this is a game to you. Just let the girls and me go. Quack. This is like a one-way road kind of deal. You collect all three gem worlds in each level to move on. Okay, got it? That's the easy part. Haha, <laughs> of course it wouldn't be a game without enemies. Don't worry, they are harmless. Game Master, I swear if anything happens to me or the girls, you will pay. What did you say? You know what you must call me. I would never hurt you. You are still brand new and flawless at this game. 
Or maybe I could kill you over and over again, giving you lots of game over screens. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> now it's the time for you to chase me down this hallway. Oh god. You know what? I, I'm digging it. I'm digging the floor vibe. I don't want to fight you. I guess I will. Let's go ahead and do the fighting. What happened? Did I just like warp away? Oh no, I just started back to the beginning. That's what they do? They send me all the way back? Well, it doesn't seem to care about me necessarily. Do you do anything different, you funky looking bug? No, they just sent me back. That's okay. I can deal with that. And in fact, how about I make a go of just clearing them all out just to see if anything special happens. Oh, they come back. Okay. I think they come back. That might be a different enemy. Maybe. Kind of doubt it. Well, let's just avoid them from now on then, huh? I got one Gemerald. Let's go around. Got a second Gemerald. Wasn't sure if I... Oh, you will look fantastic, friend. Look absolutely great. I'm gonna have to find that third Gemerald, I think, before I can advance. Looks like Shift is walk slower. Looks like I'm running by default. I have no problem with that. There's our last Gemerald. Now that I have all of those, let's escape this maddening place. And move on to the next in what very well could be a series of a thousand or so levels all controlled by this piece of processed cheese game master. Good job! I think you will enjoy the next level. I've been enjoying myself so far, so the joke's on you. Although I have to say, I kind of preferred the last one. Keep bringing me tasty gemeralds, he said. It will be fun, he said. I am thinking that this game was probably made for a game jam, but I couldn't tell you which one because I don't have that information pulled up at the moment. But that's, oh, oh man, it's over there. Let's go, let's go, let's go pick it up. But that's how these things always go, right? Limited because they were made for a game jam. Ah, crap. Because they were made for a jam and right when you're really getting into the content, they end. Sometimes, very prematurely, sometimes at a spot that makes sense, but it's like, now the developer could have put more, they probably just ran out of time. Whoop. Well, we'll find out. Ah, crap. That guy's hitbox was like, really funky. Or at least it seemed so because of the um, viewing angle. Whoa, God. I start freaking out. Don't want to run into anybody else now. Okay. I'm sure our cheese friend is over here. Yes. Ha ha. He, he's a, he finds the humor in life. I'll give him that. I have something else planned for the next level. Ha ha. Follow me. Did you enjoy chasing me? Now I'm going to chase you. Shift button makes you run, by the way. I will even give you a head start. Get ready. Get set. Go! <sighs> okay, he immediately got me. The shift button does not make you run. Oh god, he is, uh... Yeah. Kind of frightening. Not going to lie. Okay, we're just gonna hold down two buttons and let go of... There we go. You run faster than I thought. Ha ha. Too easy for you, of course. Next level. Ha ha. Ha ha. Welcome to my arena. Ha ha. Now you battle. Sorry, I do not have weapons programmed. You will just have to bounce off each other to death. But first, pick a free upgrade to start with. Let's raise the, 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 the attack power. 
8 bit, huh? 8 bit is processing. Ow, punk. Surely I'll have killed you first, right? Those effects are really cool. I don't know if those are like MZ effects or particle effects or if I'm just pretending to be a huge nerd. Let's murder this guy. Yes, he's gone now. 8-Bit's health has been depleted. In fact, he has negative 3. Please have another upgrade. Let's raise my healing strength. Next, fight here. Rest? Ah, I recover health when I rest. He attacked, but missed. We need to rest again. We need to, like, probably do that a few times. Well, happily, it does work. This is kind of cool. It's like, small upgrades that probably mean quite a lot in the grand scheme of things. That was a big attack, my dude. I dig the upgrade system. That's cool. That could be really expanded upon and scaled out, and I could, I could dig a tournament fighter that's like this. Oh wow, he took seven damage. Dark Spot's health has been depleted. Please have another upgrade. Uh, this time, let's raise the attack power again. Winghead, Winghead is flapping its wings. Are you happy, Game Master? We're fighting to the death, all for your amusement. All right, let's end this. Please have another upgrade. Let's do, uh, let's, let's do, what do I want to do? Healing strength again? We'll do healing strength again. Big mouth. This is pretty dope. It's pretty sick, I'm not gonna lie. It's, it's pretty fluid. Like, it's, it may be a little repetitive just doing nothing but attacking, but I have to keep an eye on my health at the same time, so that's nice. And like, I just get to upgrade after each fight. It's rewarding. It, 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 it gives the good juice to the monkey brain. This guy has really low accuracy. <laughs> And he took 9 damage. Wow. Please have another upgrade. We're going to go at attack power. Next fighter. Oh no! No, 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 I can't. She doesn't do anything. I'm just going to do nothing. I can't be attacking the girls. There's no reason for that, right? No, I refuse. That's not, that's so counterintuitive to what I'm trying to do here. You evil bastard, why? No! <laughs> don't make me do it, I don't wanna! I'm just gonna cover health forever. You can't make me. Callie, Callie, I will get you out of this. I will never give up on you, Callie. We are here, oh. <gasps> I can attack the Game Master. The Game Master takes nine damage. Hey, you are supposed to fight each other. That is what humans like to do, they love to fight. Ha ah, ah, ha, let's have some fun. Ha ah, ah, ha, I will kill whoever loses the battle. I don't want to be here anymore. This would be a good time to try escaping. I agree, all three of us could overpower him. Good idea. Quack! Everyone attacks. That's awesome. That's a twist. The Game Master takes a lot of damage. The Game Master is thinking. The Game Master slaps you. That's it. You're just gonna walk up on stage in the middle of my comedic routine and slap me? Who would do that? Uh, okay, attack. Ow. You better only attack me. You missed, you fool. Oh, he's looking scary. I'm gonna rest. He missed. Okay, well I got full health, so I'm not scared. Let's, uh, let's... Oh, slapped again. You're kind of weak. Even though you blew yourself up to be like ten times the size, you are, you are kind of weak. Let us continue. Time skipping. All right, this one's for all the beans. Everyone attacks. And he has negative 11 health. Catherine didn't take off very much. Callie is pretty strong. The game master slaps me. How are you still alive? You should not, you should not be alive. Interesting. Very interesting. How much health do you actually have? This is like a breath of fire battle. You remember breath of fire? You'd fight the bosses. You'd get them all the way down and they just wouldn't die, they still had a little sliver of health left that continued on for sometimes 100% of the battle. Do you remember? Do you remember Moat? The, uh, one of the four elite bosses in Breath of Fire before you attempted to go fight the, uh, would-be last boss? Moat. Moat was a pain. Moat was such a pain. 
in my arse. Moat just did not die. I was like every healing item I had, every last flipping healing spell until I ran out of MP and Moat did nothing but attack me and, and debuff and poison my team or whatever he did and I was on my last leg but eventually I killed Moat and when I did I was so shocked that I had finally defeated him and I got done and of course in Breath of Fire you've got to continue leaving the dungeon after you kill the boss you've, you've got all of the risk of the random enemy encounters and everything all over again and it's like oh god now I have to actually leave this place and the enemies were tough and I hated it but I got to a save point and I was so relieved I didn't die and I didn't have to fight moat all over again and that's the story of the worst boss battle I think I've ever had in any RPG finally holy crap I knew he probably had to take a hundred more the game master collapses on the floor I'm out of here. Let's go. Follow me. Mallard, this looks like a projection room. <laughs> hey, Catherine, it's your ugly couch. I have never been so glad to see it until now. Wow, it really is my couch. Bloodstains and everything are all there. Ugh. This has to be the way out. I'm going in. Let's go. Did I, did I make it? I made it! It worked! We're back in the real world! <laughs> this is just our world. There is still the human world out there. Well, don't worry about that. Wherever we are, it's better than being trapped in that game. There must be more copies of this game. The store I got it from was closed up when I tried to return the game. That was not the only copy that I seen there. There were more for sale. That could not be good. <laughs> I'm still weirded out about the whole human world thing. Maybe we are still characters in a game. Like the Game Master said. You know? Could be. A ranking? Really? What determined that? Is there other ranking? Are there other endings? Trapped Like Animals by Wrath of Wood, May 2022. MV. Very good. Very, very interesting. Very good. Well. Thank you for playing. Thank you for making the game, Wrath of Wood. I will always, always indulge an MV3D project, always. And that was it, Trapped Like Animals. I don't know that we trap our animals in video game worlds. We do occasionally force them to fight each other, which is quite inhumane and probably, probably on its way out as a practice in most places now, I would hope. Uh, but uh, we're, we're still working on making Mallard's um, reliable, permanent parts of the um, justice system in order to utilize them for their their highly proficient and developed deductive skill set. So, I'm a big fan. Anyways, I'd like to see another adventure with Detective Mallard. Maybe not one about the video game, maybe a separate written adventure starring Mallard. I'm a sucker for detectives. Uh, being the main heroes of a game. I think that's a great premise because you've got all these realistic skills and tools at your disposal and the story if done right It can be like icing on the cake, but not icing. That's too sweet Icing that is the perfect amount of sweetness that you can that Facilitates you being able to eat lots of pieces of cake without feeling bad. I don't know where I'm going with this I probably need to get going uh, thank you very much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed. Comment anything you like down below, and I will see you tomorrow. Have a fantastic day. Till then, bye for now.